Hello everyone, how's it going? Dr. Incompetent here, and let's play some Tiny Chaos, shall we? I'm checking out this game for part of the 2024 Play Beyond Fest. I did something already last week for the Fest, and I get to do another one, which is awesome, courtesy of Game Ticker, and... I just love checking out new indie games, so let's see what this is all about. Now, I've never played it, so I'm going to go ahead and do the tutorial. All right. Tino says, welcome to a simulation room, soldier. I'm your friendly robot, Tinos, here to assist you. Let's get started with the basic movement in this game. All right, so I'm going to try using a controller and see how it goes. Now move toward the glowing marker ahead. All right, I'm going to move toward the glowing marker. I'm taking a zigzag path. You can dodge roll over enemies. When you dodge roll, you will have a brief moment of invulnerability. All right. Um, press spacebar to dash, but... Okay. Uh, let's see. Oop. Okay, there we go. So it's A while moving on the controller. Great work. Now let's talk about combat. Now I will teach you how the attack system works in here. Once you're in range, your weapon will automatically attack the nearest enemy. Just focus on positioning yourself strategically and unleashing your skills. Alright, so this is probably a, uh, you know, action roguelite survivors type game, looks like. Look at these slime men. Oh boy, they're coming at me. Congratulations, you've completed the basic tutorial. Should you ever feel the need to further sharpen your skills, don't hesitate to come back for more training. I got it. Okay, well, that's how I like it. Nice and easy. Let's play the real game. And looks like we can be Alex. Uh, we can... We probably don't have access to anybody else. I know we have Zane. Okay, so I can either be Zane, the Ironclad Knight, or Alex, the Mercenary Soldier. Let's start with Alex. He's got a headband, looking good. And we're going to go... Um, oop, not with multiplayer. Just with... Yeah, there we go. Um, select stage. Uh, let's go ahead and do medium difficulty on the meadow. I'm ready for it. I was like, I'm on fire? That doesn't seem fair. That's a that's a rough start. Okay. So, there's a panel that you can... That's cool. You can bring up or hide that panel at any time. It gives you um, statistics about yourself. I don't think I need those right now. I'll tell you what. Oh, boy. I am slow. Um, okay. So, what do I want? Um, attack speed, crit chance, or damage? Let me damage. Good lord. Plus four damage. Would you like to add 40%? Yes. Yes, I would. Okay. Um, I could get a unique weapon evolution. Uh, dodging reloads 20% ammo. I think that seems pretty cool. I don't know when I'm going to have to... Oh, yeah, you see ammo in the upper. So I guess if I just dodge all the time, I'm just reloading. Just making it happen. Um... I want more damage. Give me the damage. Ooh. Oh boy. Right. Oh, epic damage boost. Yes, yes, thank you. Now look at that. You could see I'm doing 27 damage per shot. Uh, 1.5 seconds attack speed. Uh, the movement speed is really tempting. This is a rare hit point bonus. Uh, I'm, I'm actually going to take the movement speed. I know it sounds weird, but um, I'm slow. I'm slow as molasses. Special enemy. Now, I didn't agree to that. Um, ooh, plus 10 ammo sounds great. 75% critical damage is awesome, but I, my crit chance is... 1%. 
So, let's go ahead with the extra ammo. Oh, right, I caught on fire there. Don't I have some kind of special ability? Let me see if I could use that. Um, max stamina. That does seem good. Stamina you use for rolls and such, but no, I'm just going to go damage. Oh, treasure chest. Give me that. Yes, please. Um, okay, legendary. Attacks now bounce once to other nearby enemies. Oh my gosh. They deal 10 plus regular damage times 50% skill amplifier as damage. Goodness gracious. Um, that is insane. Yeah, give me that. Let me see what that ricochet looks like. Oh, I get another one too. Uh, we need this attack speed for sure. Oh my god, look at the ricochet. Oh, I'm incredibly powerful. Yes. Uh, no, make me attack faster. Even though it's just basic, I don't care. I'm all attack. Shoot him. Um, skill amplification. So this would make my ricochet do more damage because it scales on that. So let's try that. I got a potion, which I suppose, like, restores my health, but I was at full health. Uh, ooh, plus six damage, yeah. You could get these re-rolls if you want to re-roll, but... No, I'm happy with what I've been seeing. 50% um, skill amp? Yes. You can see now, this my ricochet was doing, like, 13 damage in the blue. Now it's doing 22 damage. How about that? Um, no, we'll take damage bonus. I want that avocado. Jam avocado. Um, increase substantial percent of reload speed. Uh, yeah, re reloading is brutal. 4% crit, though, is oof. Now, I'll take the reload. I don't like reloading at all. Ooh, look at that movement speed. Yes, yes, yes. I'm actually not moving like a slug. I like it. Epic damage? Yep. Yep. All day. Um, just more damage. Just more. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Um... I'm just going to keep going with skill amp. I might get another skill that needs that. That's a lot of hit points. I'll take one hit point boost. I haven't done anything for survivability because I've all gone only attack. It's working out well, but... Um, yeah, there's a mini boss. I was going to say, you know there's going to be somebody difficult coming. Um, I will take the 4% crit chance at this point. Okay, the mini boss is toast. Every potion adds 5% damage resistance and 5% damage, capped at 20%. Um, so that's permanent? 25% chance to heal 10 plus max hit points. Um, no, I want the stalwart body. I want the 5% damage boost. I, you know, I don't get potions that much, but let's go. Um, let's see. Well, now we see four. Uh, I want attack speed. Now, I might want to actually move. I don't know if there's anything to explore on the level. Mm-hmm. Attack speed for sure. I mean, the ricochet is incredible. It goes so far. Ah, 
All right, I picked up the potion. Let's see what that if that does the trick. Okay. This is plus six damage. Yeep. Next time I see a potion, I'm going to uh, bring up my panel and see if I can register the 5% boost. My basic attacks are doing 62. Dodging reloads 50%. Whoa. Yes. Alright, here. Let me look at this. Alright, my attack is 63. I pick up the potion. Yep, 66. So it did uh, improve. Adds 5 hit point cost to dodge roll. 2 damage and 1% skill amp after dodge roll. Every time? Reflect the damage taken enhanced by player missing hit points back to the enemy. Hmm. Or double current skill amp. Let's double our skill amp. I don't want to take damage when rolling. It's just I would kill myself. I feel like because I just roll all the time. Um, and we'll do a we'll go ahead and do a four plus four damage. Okay, um, yep, attack speed. Oh, blue guy. Watch out for blue man. So I'm just going to walk south. Just for no good reason. To see if the stage repeats, or to see if uh, there's, like treasure chests or anything in the environment that I'm missing. It looks like there's a elephant graveyard or something here. I don't know. Archaeological dig site. Oh, that guy threw something at me. What a jerk. Alright. Well, now it's time to haul loop back. Mini boss. Ooh, the mini boss is serious. Was serious. All right. Convert 80% stamina to hit points. Two hit point regeneration. 10% um, damage resistance. Evolve in 120 seconds. Um, I don't know about that. Uh, the flea boots could be good. They just help you run away. Six percent crit chance sounds good. My crit chance is now eleven percent. Remember what it was one at the beginning. I actually want to pick up that potion so that I can get my you know, 5% boost, but it looks like I'm full on potions. I need to intentionally take damage. Oh, I took some damage. There we go. 76.8. Crit chance. Let's go. Now I need to start taking crit damage now that I have a good crit chance. Oh, these guys aren't dying instantly. Alright. It's time to go back to the plus damage well. It has kind of like a Brotado feel to it, except the level is enormous, like a regular Survivor's. Um, well, I was saying damage. Let's do damage. Oh, there was my, fl there was my flea boots kicking in. You see how fast I move for a second. That was pretty sweet. Damage. I don't like that they're just not dying 
immediately. Something is wrong. They promised they would die. Okay, here we go. 50% um, crit damage. There we go. So you can see, like, I basically hit... I hit for 86. Um, but if I crit... Uh, 10 ammo. 50% crit damage. Reload speed. No, we want ammo. Reloading is no good. Ooh, 50% stats of chosen upgrade every time you level up. That's really good. It's better than the other things. Um, it reduces the stamina of dodge roll, but the stamina has never been an issue for me. The issue is that there's a cooldown on your dodge roll that I've noticed. Oh dear, now they're coming to hit me hard. Um, plus three reroll chance. Uh, I'll just take a crit chance. That's fine. I am not picking up that potion. You must need to really... Like, my pickup radius is horrifying. Now, now I was talking about stamina. Now look how bad it is. Um, crit damage. We need to start killing stuff somehow. Okay, um, 25 hit points looks pretty good, but uh, we need damage. <laughs> well, I got hit, but I just ran away. Any boss, but I'm struggling to defeat just this regular horde of enemies. How do you expect me to handle a mini boss? Oh, look, there's a red avocado. Um, six damage. Yes, we definitely need that. Oh my god, he exploded. I think just more damage is pretty good. They condensed into a super gem. Uh, let's see. Split your attack into three. Deal 30% damage each. Multi-shot. If my multi-shots also ricochet, that's pretty sweet. Gain 5% and... Da gain 5 damage and 2 crit chance per level for the next 10 levels. Uh, I'm going to take multi-shot, even though it's probably not good. But I need some more AoE. Ooh, plus 9 damage. There you go. Yeah, it's funny. The, um, the ricochet... I don't know if I get all three ricochets, but I definitely get one. And the ricochet damage is not divided. So the ricochets actually do more than the basic hit. Um, we'll take the damage bonus.
Uh oh. What is this insanity? Who's this guy? I didn't agree to this. Is this Frogman? Oh, Goblin King or something? You can't make more goblins. That's unacceptable. Oh my god, this guy's hit point pool is pretty wild. Uh oh. Okay. I gotta shake and bake these red lasers. Okay, they're not stomping. I was like, they'll stop, right? I mean, they kind of did. Oh my god, he's throwing acid. Don't do this to me, dude. Took it right in the kisser. Exploding guys. Classic trick. There's a potion down here. It's hard to see, but I'm gonna go get it. Well, I was poo-pooing on stamina, now I'm hitting the wall. Oh my god. Oh god, I've been hit. We did it. This man is dead. Hidden leg. Yes. We need leg power. Movement speed. Give it to me. Am I faster? Slightly. Alright, so now we're on the bonus stage. I guess this is probably like, see how long you can survive. So, we got to the first boss and we defeated it. And I'd love to know what you think so far of Tiny Chaos. I'm going to put a link to the game's Steam page in the description below so you can check out more of it. And remember, I was looking at this game via the Play Beyond 2024 Fest and Game Ticker. And I have to say, it's a very charming addition to the action RPG roguelite survivors type game so let me know what you think in the comments below and everyone thank you so much for watching take care